Round seven of the WRC Rally Poland, based in the town of Milowaki in the northeast of the country. Estonian Oytanak on the podium here last year, very much at home on Poland's ultra fast, smooth gravel tracks, setting a blistering early pace. In hot pursuit, Volkswagen's Andreas Mikkelsen flying through the dusty stage is on the limit and very nearly over it there. Mikkelsen leading for much of the opening day but forced to concede the top spot to Tanak by Friday evening. Poland second only to Finland in terms of sheer speed and all too easy to come unstuck as privateer Lorenzo Batelli almost discovered. The Italian doing well to retain control of his Fiesta in stage eight. Not quite so lucky, WRC2 youngster Marius Assen. A big off in stage 13, wrecking his car and his rally. The crew thankfully unharmed. Sunday saw a change in conditions. Heavy rain catching out Frenchman Stefan Lefebvre, clipping the bank into a spin. Lefebvre though able to limp to service and continue through to the end of the rally. And then disaster for Tanak. A puncture in the penultimate stage costing him more than 35 seconds and what had seemed to be his first ever WRC victory. A cruel blow. Mickelson taking full advantage, safely negotiating the final stage to come home and clinch his second WRC victory after his win in Spain last year. Contrasting emotions, joy for Mickelson. Tanak in tears, consoled by world champion Ogier. And it's a sixth different winner of the season. We pushed all weekend so hard. I mean, it was all about luck who got out and without problems or not. And we were the lucky ones. But still, it has been a, a great performance this weekend and uh, one weekend I will never forget. Confirmation then. Victory for Norway's Andres Mikkelsen. 26.2 seconds, the winning margin ahead of Tanak, who was 2.3 seconds ahead of Hayden Padden, the Kiwi, in third. Watch the most spectacular moments from every rally. Get WRC Plus with all rally highlights now.